Good day, everyone. I am Inali Arnoche and I'm going to talk about basket weave method. But first, I have here a quote to start our discussion. Nature is written in mathematical language, as quoted by Galilei Galilei, an Italian astronomer, physicist, and engineer. The great book of nature, wrote Galileo, is written in mathematical language. Scientists do not use mathematics merely as a convenient way of organizing the data. They believe that mathematical relationships reflect real aspects of the physical world. And we can deny the fact that yes, almost everything in this world has mathematics on it. So it is very necessary for us to better understand and go deeply what is the meaning of mathematics. So we will going to discuss the definition of matrix, elements or parts of matrix, theory of basket weave method, and example for solving basket weave method. So first, what is a matrix? A matrix is a set of numbers arranged in rows and columns so as to form a rectangular array. So this is what a matrix looks like. We have here a matrix consisting of three rows and three columns. The top one or the top line in color red arrow is our row and our yellow arrow is considered as our column. In describing matrices, the format is rows times column. It, it's, it's like how many rows times how many columns. Just like in this example, we have three rows and three columns. So it is called three by three matrix. Let's move on to the rules of calculating two by two and three by three matrices using basket weave method. The basket weave method is for two by two and three by three matrices only. Here, we add the diagonal product of a square matrix as we go left to right and subtract the diagonal product as we go right to left. The resulting value will be the value of our determinant. So here is an example of a matrix, a 2 by 2 matrix, and we're going to solve it. So first, we will add the diagonal product going from left to right. So what are the elements of the diagonal from left to right? It is positive 5 and positive 1. So positive 5 times positive 1 that will give us a positive 5. So it will not change our, our operation because we, we are uh, determining the diagonal product of left to right. So it is positive. So for step 2, next, we will going to subtract the diagonal product going from right to left. So that's why we have a negative sign before negative 3 and positive 2. So negative 3 times positive 2 is negative 6 times negative is equal to positive 6. So now add the results and we will get a positive 11 or the value of our determinant. So next, we have a 3 by 3 matrix. For larger matrices, it is the same process, except we need to recopy all but one of the column of the matrix or two to the right or of the original matrix. Then we do the basket weave method. As you can see, we copy two columns from the original matrix. So for step one, uh, we will going to add the diagonal products going from left to right that is in the brown, col uh, brown colored arrow. So we have for the first diagonal, we have one, positive five, and negative four. For the second, we were going to add neg uh, negative three times negative one times negative two to the first diagonal and going to add the last diagonal, 
product, we have positive 4, positive 2, and positive 3. And will give us positive 2. So for step 2, we will going to take the negative of the sum of the diagonal products going from right to left. It is in red colored arrow. So we have negative 3 times positive 2 times negative 4 plus 1 times negative 1 plus positive, I times positive 3, sorry, plus 4 times positive 5 times negative 2. That will give us a sum of positive 19. So lastly, uh, we're going to add the two sums together to get the determinant. So we have negative 2 and positive 19. So I'm sorry, we, uh, for step 1, we will go in, uh, it is uh, negative 2. Uh, negative 20 plus negative 6, negative 26 plus 20. Yes, it is negative 2. So it is the negative 2 plus in step 2, we got uh, positive 19 that will give us a result of positive 70. So thank you for today. Um, I hope you learned something from me about basket weave method and God bless us all. See you next time.